mother brings in her seven-month-old baby. Uh, it, he has a fever of 103 and it's rising and uh, she got nervous, gave him some Advil. And uh, here they are, mother and baby. I'm going to use the eye mate to find out what's going on with this uh, little guy. Here comes the baby. Okay, so we're going to put the contact which we usually use around the forehead. So we'll put those contacts around the trunk of the baby and we're going to put it in the back. Alright, it's okay. Yeah. We'll make sure it's on the skin. <laughs> make sure it's on the skin. connected to uh, the iMate system and we're now going to calibrate. So the young fellow is going to be calibrated. Calibration is a handshake between the computer and the patient. We're now in the Nate profile right here and we're going to take a measurement which is the full test panel which means the entire Nate program and uh, it takes a minute and a half. It's, it's strolling through all of the uh, Nate vials, all 20 kids. And in a moment we'll know what's wrong with this young fellow. 20 Nate kits equals 1560 items and it takes about a minute and a half for the iMate system to run through that. Okay. Okay, we have a measurement. Number one is a bacteria, bacteria number 110. It's Nate Rickettsia typhi, and number eight is a bacteria. Uh, now, this young man has been at the hospital a couple days ago to visit his father, and so maybe he picked up something there, but uh, obviously it, it, it's a bacterial issue. So we're going to treat his immune system for, um, uh, and focus the immune system on this bacterial situation. We're treating the first bacteria, which is bacteria 110, which is this one right here, and so we're in the biofeedback mode now, and he's getting the treatment through the harness. Um, and uh, the combinations I put in is BBF, digestive enzyme, which is base, and DNA and hypothalamus. Now uh, this is from experience, I know whenever there's bacterial infections, uh, those are the combinations that are very common. So I use them to focus the immune system on this bacteria. The iMate features tri-vector technology to feedback the frequencies chosen by the practitioner. So we treated this young man for three minutes, which of course was not enough. Uh, but the rectification is only 9%. Uh, so 9% is obviously not enough. That's why the 15 to 20 minute uh, treatment uh, period that Dr. Naputipat teaches is a very good uh, time frame. So we're going to treat him a little more. I'm going to do his spinal points now. So, come here, young man. And I'm going to do his spinal points. Uh, his contacts are right here. Over his spine. He's pretty hot. Okay. Alright. Well, I'll take care of that. Uh, uh, the rectification uh, is now at 81%, uh, so we're going to leave that and we're going to treat that second bacteria, which is a streptococcus, uh, and then his treatment will be complete. Uh, we treated uh, bacteria 110 to 81%, and now we're treating a streptococcus. Uh, and uh, but remember the combinations here were BBF, base, DNA, and hypothalamus. Uh, those are the basic combinations that we treated out him with and that completes his treatment so I would expect him to be much better by tomorrow. The treatment uh, of this young lad is finished and uh, here's a, a report that we can save 
and it will show us uh, the things that showed up. This bacteria 110 and the bacteria 87, uh, those are the items that we treated his immune system for uh, with the combinations as I explained earlier. I performed a NAID treatment on a seven months old with biofeedback technology focused on immune function as it relates to bacteria. Energetically, bacteria 110 was rectified 88%. The streptococcus was rectified energetically 100%.